Hello, best friend, and welcome, welcome back to my channel. I hope you're having a fabulous day. If this is the first time you're watching my channel, my name is Sebastian, and I welcome you guys with open arms. I do pop culture videos every single day, honey. So if you're looking for a new messy best friend, you have found me. Grab a snack and a drink. Hit that subscribe button, girl, because listen, we got to talk about Ms. Haley Road Bieber. And, um, but first, I have to tell you guys, I mentioned this in my previous video, bitch but damn the emotional roller coaster that i am on bitch you would think i bought the fast pass the you know the the skip the line bitch because it's over and over and over guys is anyone else dealing with this bitch i mean i just i can't like i'm one moment crying the next moment i'm singing my heart will go on the next moment i'm you know i, I i'm saying like you know I, I don't all these crazy things bitch you know i'm just like girl Calm down. I need to put on like Lizzie McGuire movie and shut the fuck up and mind my own business because like I just this is just it's just too much. Like Ariel, what do you think, bitch? You know what I mean? Uh, anyways, when you are all emotional, what do you guys do? I need your advice, please. Okay. Anyways, uh, we got to talk about Hailey Bieber because there's a lot of talk about her. She's been very busy on social media, you guys. Like, literally, I don't know. Let me see if I can find it real quick because, I mean, she just released, like, her glazed donut uh, to promote, you know, her, her glaze. But look, I mean, you cannot fit one more story in her Instagram. She's been real, real, real busy. And today, Justin Bieber marked his great, uh, grand return on social media. But, oh girl, let me catch my breath, bitch. But some fans believe that the only reason that she's so active right now and that Justin is back is to take attention away from Miss Selena Gomez and her new single, Single Soon, which, by the way, bitch, we are going to have a live listening party. So as soon as I know what time that song is coming out, bitch, we are going to listen to it together. I will be live here. I will be live on TikTok. I will be live on my OnlyFans account that I do not have. And I will be live on fucking MySpace, okay, bitch? But I will be live everywhere, bitch. Even if a UFO comes and adopts me, I will be live from our spaceship and our wonderful uh, corner office that we share because he believes that I also have a right to, you know, spill my tea up there in space in orbit. It, okay while i'm orbiting his world girl he's allowing me to spill tea from there okay bitch oh god could you please help me sir <laughs> it was just like a lie i don't know bitch uh anyways so um so yeah some people are believing that this is you know Haley's way of distracting you know blah, blah blah listen let me tell you guys something and i'm just gonna you know i i could obviously feed into the toxic to toxicness but i also just i i think it's important to be as real as possible here okay forever and ever until the end of time Hailey Bieber, Justin Bieber, and Selena Gomez will always be connected in the sense that anything that they release, anything that they do, people are going to have all their eyeballs on, girl, all their balls, all their eyeballs on each of them to see if one reacts, to see if someone, you know, says something, to see if someone comments, to see if it's about someone. You know, we've always often talked about whenever Justin or Selena release a song, people are going to dissect it, you know, Anola Holmes it, like, you know, make sure if it's, you know, they want to see if it's about the other person. So as much as I love the mess, as as much as I love the tea, as much as I love everything, I could definitely believe that maybe Haley would be capable of something like that. But I also feel that, I mean, I'm giving her benefit of the doubt here, girl, okay? Because I feel like, listen, bitch, you, you, you know, you can't be, you know, uh, so, you know, on top of what, you know, your husband's ex is doing. So I'm giving Haley the benefit of the doubt. I'm going to be like, okay, girl, you know what? Uh, I don't, I, I hope that she is not, you know, doing everything just to, you know, spite Selena, you know, so it, for the three Hailey Bieber fans here, Shirley Myrtle, Rob Girl, I hope you know that I come with in peace, bitch, okay, is this the peace sign, is this Star Wars, what is this, I, I don't remember, um, but listen, yeah, I feel like in my heart, um, they will always be connected, and 
I, 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 I wouldn't want to believe that Hailey Bieber has like a leaked, you know, copy of Selena Gomez's schedule and she's like, you know, trying to get, do anything in her power to like, you know, get attention. But it, it is, again, a coincidence that Justin comes back the day after Selena Gomez breaks the internet with the TikTok. It's a, it's a coincidence that, you know, he's finally seen happy. It's, you know, that's something that, you know, we haven't seen in a while, but unfortunately, or fortunately for some, they didn't even post a picture together. They posted it separate. Well, yeah, separate actually. Justin posted pictures of him with Justine Skye and Normani, who has not been able to release her first album yet. I still don't understand why. And Hailey Bieber was posted in a picture that Justine Skye posted. And I just find it so crazy that it was yesterday the day that you know selena gomez broke the internet and of course selena's tiktok was uh you know everyone is accusing her that it's that's about justin um i think what what i do think it's a little bit you know and i would be curious like i would i would literally like if i could shape shift i'd become like a fly just to see like really what goes on in the Bieber household. Like when Selena Gomez releases this song, you know, everybody's gonna listen to it. And if it's about a toxic relationship ending for her to then be able to be with that person or somebody in a toxic relationship wants to cheat on their wife with Selena, whatever the song is about, um, I feel like, will Haley listen? Like I could like be like, you know, like, you know, Oh girl, look. Oh girl, that's Haley. Bzzz. Girl, she is repeating single again soon. Girl. Oh hey, Justin. Oh that glazed donut looks good, bitch. And then I go on the glazed donut, and then she kills me. But no, I don't know, bitch. Like I feel like you know, there's always she's always going to be you know associated with Selena. She's always going to be associated, you know, in that kind of triangle. Um. But in my in my in my truth, I just feel like Selena it has so moved on from this. If I'm being honest, I really do. I feel like she's living her best life. I don't think that everything is about Justin. I don't think that all her existence is about Justin. Um, the only reason that I I think that maybe Justin sometimes isn't okay is because the way he looks so sad. But if he would be looking happy as he did last night, I don't think anybody would say anything. Nobody would judge. Nobody would have these theories. Nobody would have all these controversial thoughts, you know, and everybody, everyone would be like, he's super happy with Haley and that's it. But because he's always looked so miserable, because he's been disappeared from social media and, and all of that, it just adds on to the to the talk and the 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 you know the theories that Justin is not is not okay and that of course puts Haley in the light of you know the bad one so i don't know you guys i feel like my phone best friend listen my phone died before i got to finish the video then i laid here and i started going into cuddle land with my with my doggy and I forgot to end the video. But now I was like, girl, let me go back to my closet. And I'm like, you know what, bitch? No. Mm -mm. You know what's prettier than my closet? This one right here. Um, I want to just take a second before I let you guys go. Thank you guys so much. High five. High five. High five. High five. Thank you guys so much for allowing me to be me. I was just editing th that video and... Holy shit. I mean, Mercury Retrograde has me in a chokehold, bitch. I'm talking about being a bee, a being a, bub, a UFO. Like, damn. Um, but you know what? I'm just so grateful that we build a community where we can be ourselves. We, we, we get to be, you know, quirky. We get to be dehydrated. We just get to be ourselves. And, and I'm so thankful that you guys allow me to be me. And I hope you know that here you can be you and you will be loved just as you are. So I love you. Actually, let me take that back, okay? I'm sorry, I'm taking it back. We love you and we're very grateful for you. And we will see you guys in our next video. Right? Say bye, Mateo. See you in the next video. See you in the next video. Bye, bye, bye. See if he falls asleep on camera. When you wish.
Upon a star. Girl, he's over it. Bye.